Hey, good morning, people. <coughs> Let's get cooking. Busy day today. Let's get rid of that. And let's find the notes. And let's go. Peter Billingham, welcome to the man who never sleeps here. Yeah. Got a few hours last night. Much needed after last night's stream, I shall tell you. Um, so, main account time. Check of the bags. Yes, yes, yes. Possibly. Probably not. So, we are going with Kimmy's shot. I've just seen it this morning. I think this is the shot Ian played last night. So we're going to use one of these. I think everybody should have these because they were given out free. Win four, power three. Side spin one. So let's see about this then. Morning, Alex. How are you doing, bud? Where's my screenshot gone? There it is. Hey, Gary. Thanks for the good luck, brother. Right, hole one, let's go. Let's go. What's at the top? May as well have a wee look. 29, two to three 29s. Very nice, one, two, three, three 28s. And a plethora, I would imagine, of 27s and sixes. So, no worries, no worries. Hopefully no mistakes today, not like yesterday, not like last night. So we're going to go, as I say, with Kimmy's shot on hole one, which if you haven't seen it yet, it's a beaut. It seems great proof as well. Whisper it quietly. Morning, Jason. Thank you for the good luck. KK, hello, welcome, welcome. Thank you for the good luck too. Let's see if we can do this. One to one plus two rings, she says. Two yard mark, red ring touching the rough. I've forgotten the spins. I think it's, that was uh, unfortunate. I think it's half back and one left, I can't remember. One left spin, thank you Alex. One left spin in, is it half back spin? Yeah. I should really write this down actually while he's taking a shot. Let's do that now. So it's one to one plus two. One back. No. What did you say? Zero point two backspin. Okay, thank you. So this is plus two on a sniper 10. If they give it a sniper nine, then you would have to obviously probably go at the plus four mark, but we'll see. So we're gonna go with point two back and one left. Okay. Of course we have to select it again. Wasting valuable seconds. <laughs> one left. Did you say point two back? Feels okay. And we want plus two. And then she goes one to one plus two rings, so 9.4. She's about there. Oh, that's a great left though. That's a Ballinger. Let's see how a Ballinger plays. <laughs> so it's not Ballinger proof. <laughs> Close though, I like it, I like the shot. So that was a great left. Didn't affect the line whatsoever. 
did affect the pace, which is to be expected. So I will be switching to this. Look at that. I don't know if that could have been any closer. So when she pops. Not sure what Kingmaker would do here. Um, I know Kimmy's video shows it with a wind 4 and a wind 5 ball. But I'm going to try that ball because I've got that on all accounts, I think. What's that ball called? A vintage. Vintage. And if anyone's tried it with a sniper nine, do let me know <coughs> what the difference is. <coughs> Who have I annoyed at PD? Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's all set up now. I'll, I'll let him take it. Him or her. But that looks like that's that's the way to go. I think so. <clears throat> one to one plus two rings, 0 0.2 backspin and one left spin. I have shared Kimmy's, because she's got a video on her channel, um, exactly breaking it down with three different shots, all of them drop, different balls, blah, blah, blah. Um, so go and check that out. I've put the link in. Oh, this got no side spin. It's got no side spin. Uh, I've put the link in the posts on the 19th and on Elite, where I posted my now way out of date effort for hole one. Six, eight, we'll go eight, eight-ish, nearly nine. <coughs> and there's the perfect we needed on hole one. But yeah, I like that shot. That shot's got legs. It's got legs. Hey Pete, good morning to you sir. How are you this fine and fresh Friday where I am? Not as cold as it was yesterday here, but... You'd still want a jacket on. <coughs> Let's put it that way. Okay, two. Thor's sniper. A kingmaker. Where's the kingmakers? Yeah. Lovely. Oh, is it raining there? Oh dear. It is at least dry here, but yeah, chilly, chilly, chilly. So the plan today, what is it, we're a little bit late, I was going to be on at 8, then it was 8.30, and then the laptop died, so I had to find a charger and blah blah blah. But um, I'm going to stream one round now, with this one, clearly. Then I will have to charge the tablet, because it no longer makes it through two rounds anymore. Um, and then Mr Ballinger should be ready. New iPad in hand, to delight you. From around half past ten. Ten, half ten, something like that. And then I'll maybe pop back on after he's done one. So, how much of that you'll see, or can see, I don't know, but plenty golf clash, plenty finger golf to watch today, if you're so inclined. I know Matt is already on, I think I saw that when I was logging in there, Erelic Gaming, which I'm sure you all know. So I'd imagine he's doing his pro rounds today. So if you're looking for pro, don't miss that. And as it's Friday, you'll find a lot of people streaming today. That's a nice shot. Further right. I want to be further right here. This half of the fairway. Good morning, Nick. Thank you for the good luck, sir. Thank you, thank you. Eight three eight one. So, a bit less bold on the starting spot now. I'm gonna go a little bit more topspin as well. And eight three eight one. The 
Just hit it, I suppose. So that's a little bit more to the right. Still plenty of yards to play with. Could have gone another five yards there, but but it'll do. And I'm going to now use the left spin with this. Not the right spin. I've been using right spin all week. But left seems a nicer, a nicer route to the flag. Oh dear. And there's a coffee crisis in the household. Well, it's not a coffee crisis. It's a milk crisis. So, until I get to the shop, after this stream, there is no coffee to be had. Which is most upsetting. Right. <coughs> use some top and some left and 10% it'll be one to one plus one ish it always is backing up a bit because I don't want to be an overpower I'm going to go four and four this does keep coming up a little bit short so I'd like to be through the hole which might be too bold who knows Let's just call that nearly 10. And a great right this time. No coffee is no golf, yeah. <coughs> That's clearly going to miss right. A little bit pacey. Well, I don't know. We'll maybe, we'll maybe get that at the weekend on one account. I think that's all I can expect here. So that's two. Three's a QB. Or is it? Or is it? Is three a QB? At some point today, I'm going to try the APOC single bounce rough bump again. But maybe not now. Who's that with a 29 in Masters? Beautiful. <laughs> You've still got a milkman? I wish I still had a milkman. Uh, good luck to our opponent. And let's go and try this QB. Fuji Nabang. Why has my notes gone like that? Right, we've uh, won a Titan. I do the breeze. We don't need the wind up. So going with Pete's uh, tried and tested method. We've taken 4.2 off whatever the wind is. Pin chest. Anything good. Apache, no. <coughs> right, here we go. Hey, Terry. Good evening to you, sir. Good morning. There we go. You know Terry's here when Siri thinks I'm talking to her. Bugger off, Siri. <laughs> right, we're not first. Gotcha, eh? Welcome. Thank you for the good luck. Question, how many accounts do y'all play? I play four in expert and one in pro. And I have two rookies that I don't play much anymore. Um, so yeah, that's how many I have. How many do you have? How many does everyone have? There you are. Pete has three accounts, one pro, two expert. The person that I know of who has the most... Is uh, Michael Moss Senior, 
Mr. Mossy. I think he has 12 or 13 accounts and he plays them all. So Marco here looks like he's trying a similar kind of shot. I don't know how he's adjusting that. Perhaps he's on a PC. So he's not gone full curl. It's nice though. It's a lovely soft landing that. Lovely soft landing. No deal. We've reverted to um, Kimmy's shot. I'll, I'll tell you in a second. Uh, let me just remember what I'm doing. Five, five, and two, one. Try there today. So 9.3 minus 4.2 will be 5.1 rings. 5.1 rings. Great left as always on this shot. <laughs> How was the line? That's what I'm interested in. Ooh, it's getting closer. It's getting closer. So I like that. I like five and a half back, 2.1 right. I have seen somebody posted and shared it with me directly, actually, um, all the backspin and all the right spin, I want to say. Same shot, but with all the backspin, all the right spin. And dropped it. So... We'll see, we'll see. Um, there we are, everyone's telling us how many accounts they've got. Peter Bulling of four, all pro. The all pro star, ease of notes exactly. It's often a consideration. One pro, one expert for Jason. It's got to be Mossy, right? He has to have the most, surely. Well, not have the most, but have the most that he plays. Unless, I'm not sure how many Chris has got, GC Addict TV. I know he has a lot. But I don't know that he plays them all. Nick's got one expert, three pro and a rookie. Three divisions, Nick. Ooh. I used to hate taking notes for three divisions. Gotcha's got two expert, two pro, two rookie. Ooh, work cut out there then. Work cut out there. Uh, so no, back to hole one, Dale. Um, we switched to the Kimmy shot. Which, you should be able to rewind the stream and have a look. But um, for the purposes of brevity, it's... What if it was first? It's a sniper and a vintage ball. So it's a power three win four. Or you could use a power three win five. It doesn't really matter. You're going to go a 0 0.2 backspin and one right spin. And it's one to one plus two rings. So what could be easier? With the red ring on the left rough at plus two yards. Very simple setup. I hit great left and was bob on line. Literally right on line. And stopped a ball here short. So I like it, and I will be persistent with it as we move on, so that's all I've got to say about that, as Mr. Paladin would say. Kimmy dropped it tonight too. Uh, hole 3, KK, or hole 1, I know she's dropping hole 1 for fun. You've seen the ace on this hole as well, Dale, nice. Yeah, of course he has Golf Clash Rival too, doesn't he, Pete? She dropped all three. Lovely. How did she play it? Do we know? Did she stream around? Does she stream rounds? I don't know if she just puts up helpful content or whether she actually streams. I'd love to see her stream if she doesn't. Anyway, we'll see, no doubt, what she did. Centurion Ball, what would that be? Win for, yeah? Absolutely. I don't have them on all my accounts, so unfortunately. Not yet. <laughs> Um, right, this is another QB. I've resigned myself to the fact that this is never going to go in all week. But I no longer care. I just don't want to make a mess of it like I did last night. And yesterday, in fact. So just the stock shot for me. 1 to 1 minus half a ring. All the left 3 back. And maybe a 12 or 1 pull angle if I'm feeling spicy. So that's that. It's different. See, some people land in here, others here. I don't know. We're going to go somewhere in here. 
as I say, I'm not not too hopeful anymore of landing this shot. So, uh, what do we say? Less half a ring, so eight point two, which is about there. So let's do the wee wee hoogie. the fashionable pull back to the tee, and then hit a great left. Just hit the rough. Don't really care where it goes now. Ooh, close though. Closer than I've uh, I've been all week. Twelve oh one pool angle, is it really necessary? The players at the higher echelons of the game would tell you it is. And if they're telling you it is, then it probably is, but to the people like me. I mean, I understand the theory that you know you're trying to control the wind in, in a single direction instead of two variables. So, it makes perfect sense to me. Perfect sense. My problem, it's fair enough in shots like this in tournaments where someone's told you it's a twelve or one pull angle, and you can just do a twelve or one pull angle. My trouble is understanding when to apply it in the tour play. Like trying to think that through quick enough in the time to take the shot. I struggle with still. It's not always obviously apparent to me, but I'm not the you know sharpest tool in the shed, so <laughs> you may have more success with it than I do. It looked like she did closer to the 5.8 and 2 right. Yeah, I started off with that. That's what Pete had in the notes, wasn't it? 5.8 and back and 2 to the right. I just found I was... I mean, not that I've taken the shot that many times, but it felt like I needed to tweak, so that's why I tweaked it, but... Maybe on the back nine, we'll play this all the backspin, all the right spin. I need to check if it is actually all the right spin. I'm not. I would have thought that'll completely change the shot entirely. But we'll have a look. Try and find the replay. You're perfect on that hole. Didn't go in, but you had a great left that went in. That's a boundary for the win. <laughs> it's a curious game, gotcha. It's a, it's an enigma. Yeah, great left, misses right. Not easy. Playing perfect, playing perfect, hitting perfect. I struggle with it when I start the round deal. I usually get better as I go on. That's not a promise, mind. <laughs> Don't hold me to it. Um, right, where is this going? I need to delete that out of the way. Hang on. My notes are all out of alignment now because I've changed them. That's better. So what are we on? Five. So, options here. I could maybe try going left here because I've got the Thor 7 with the top spin for days. I don't know this guardian shot to the right just doesn't seem I'll maybe give it one more try here and see I'm pretty much all out of ideas on this hole I'll be honest it's it's got me stumped it's got a few of us stumped I think Pete was resorting to the full on blast down the middle yesterday so if Pete and uh, JJ are stumped then you know it's tricky Hey Robert, good morning to you. It's going okay. It's going okay. We um, we've changed the shot for hole one, and it looks good. We didn't make it because we hit a great left and literally stopped on the lip, peering into the hole. <laughs> but other than that, nothing else has gone yet. But we're having some fun. No coffee today yet, though, which is upsetting me. I need to go to the shops and buy some milk. Unless, can you get coffee delivered? To Starbucks delivery? That would be nice. Right, let's not be too silly with the top spin here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's what we've been using on other clubs. And about 8 rings, so we'll just eyeball this. There's the 3, there's the 5.
did we change the guardian bag? Got that horrible feeling that we haven't changed our bag again. I hope we did. Tony, are you going for the DJ Herman rough bump? Hell no, Dixie. I ain't no fool. I'm leaving that shot to DJ. And anyone that likes it. No, no rough bumps here. Not on this hole. And good morning to you, sir. How the hell are you? Oh, thank you, Dale. I'm just reading back to those messages. Much appreciated. Kind words, indeed. Eagle is ambitious, but you've got to be ambitious still. Got to be ambitious. Got to do things other people ain't doing to win gold, usually. <clears throat> Which on this course, we'll be making hole in ones on par threes. Because that's the best chance, I think. Nobody's going to make this with any regularity. Apart from DJ Herman with his rough bump, crazy mofo. Tim Horton's coffee. We don't get that over here very much. I know you do in Belfast. I remember sitting in a Tim Horton shop. I've never seen one where I live. Did we change? Yes, we did. Right. So, 8-7. Didn't change this, did I? Idiot. So, somewhere between 6 and 7 rings. So we'll go six and a half. <laughs> Seeing as that is literally between six and seven. Six, six, let's say that. Going with extra curl today. To counter the great left that I knew was coming. <laughs> Tip ball. No. Needs to stop. Needs, the bounce needs to be shorter than that. To catch this hill. That's what you want to do. Bounce on that hill, spin, and then just trickle in. Not an easy shot, though. Not an easy shot. 31 in pro. Someone buy that man a beer. Well done, Jason. Congrats. Congrats. That's a beauty. I need to, need to see if I can get some of this Tim Hortons lark, then. We'll see. It's just where he walked out of Dixie, but opposite County Hall or whatever it's called. City Hall. That's the one I sat in when I was there. Oh dear, Terry. Oh dear, Terry. <laughs> Akash, welcome. Good luck. Let's get some booms. Thank you for coming. Thank you for uh, invigorating the crowd, because I'm not doing it with these shots. Not yet, anyway. It's always tempting to play this pot all the way up there and down. But that would be foolish. <laughs> First Terry of the day, or is that, you know, are we on to the fourth of the fifth by now? Matthew's having an awesome round in pro. Well, that's good to hear. Pass on my love and best wishes, please, Terry. And tell him I apologise, but again, this was kind of my only slot right now to stream this morning so I would rather be watching him but I can't multitask and do both <laughs> oh right Gary can you imagine him doing that <laughs> that would be interesting yeah one phone for each Terry one for the girlfriend, one for the wife. Then you could never make a mistake. I'm talking theoretically, of course. It's Joe from 19th Redemption, which I didn't even realise, and I, I've been ignoring good, good wishes all the way through this. How rude. Good luck, Joe. Don't know if you feel bad now. feel bad. I kind of hope Joe didn't say anything, because then I'll feel less bad. It's 
give him another good look just in case. We'll see. We'll see. Just over from City Hall. Well, I wish I was there. I'd go and uh, I'd go and grab one right now as well. Right, six. Six is kind of dull, really. It's another one of those you ain't gonna make it. Take your ego and bugger off. Jobs. I fear, but we'll see. Drop away, Terry. As long as it's nothing too blue. <laughs> Drop away. Oh, Matthews. Yeah, absolutely. Of course. Talk from experience about two phones. No, no. Nothing like that. I have three phones now. So I've just got a new personal phone. I've got the new... What is it? iPhone... 11, the, the one with two cameras, that's how I know the difference, I don't know what one that is, um, and I've got my old iPhone, and I've got my work iPhone, so it's like I'm sponsored by Apple, but no, they all have only the wife's number in, and nothing else. What score is he on Terry, what score is Matt shooting for, and which account is it? Is he doing one or is he doing two? Tell us, tell people what's going on over there. Fill us in. I don't like this at all. Red ring by the rock. Let's try that. And of course this is the Thor 7, so it's rings for days on the adjustment. I'm going to go 8 instead of 8-2. Nice to hit a perfect at last. Bouncing. And rolling. That'll do us. That'll do us. Get t shirt right first. <laughs> Robert. Savage. It's too early in the morning for such savagery as that. And that wound is still sore from last night, so I'll thank you to be more considerate in the future. Um, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Terry. Thank you, thank you. Hey, Tom. Thank you for the good luck. Hope we get the drops. Yes, me too. Maybe on the back nine. We're not dropping much yet on the front, but not for the want of trying. Morning, Lee. School run done. Copper made. You lucky bugger. I've got no milk. And relax to the soft tones of T. Richards. <laughs> Enjoy your copper. We have a milk crisis here in the Richardson household. And because I didn't do the school run this morning... I have not been to the shop. Matthew is minus 29, going up the last. Thinks his baby pro. Well, look at him, just absolute baller. Happened last tournament, he went sub 30. It's clearly going to happen again here. <clears throat> that could be a 30, what, 31 guaranteed? 32 possible. Let's hope he makes it. And if that's his baby pro, then he'll be filled with confidence for his main. Right, there's that slither of backspin that I always debate about. We'll leave it there. Eight six will be eight eight. Two perfect shots. Wow. Now we're talking. Which side are we going to miss today? <coughs> Left. Not enough curl. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey Phil, thank you for the good luck. Thank you very much indeed for coming. So. Didn't expect this one to go. So no harm, no foul there, really.
see if there are a few though. I'm wondering. I'm wondering. I did watch Chris GC Addict TV saying that the cat might be a better club there than the sniper. Um Probably no harm in trying, to be honest, if you've got a decent enough ball guide. Something to think on, maybe. Do you get St. James's often? Not anymore. I used to be a season ticket holder, but... um, Oh, seeing as this is coming up... Oh, it's the wrong wind. It's the wrong wind. I was going to practice the rough pump, but... Not in that wind. Um, no, I used to have a season ticket many moons ago. But got um, life got too busy and the team became... Poorly administered, let's call it that. So that got jacked in. And I haven't been for about two years now. Um, which is a shame. I like, used to try and take the boys once a year. Just to make sure their allegiances stayed fresh in the mind. Because our lass is a Middlesbrough fan for her sins. So you've got to be careful, you know. You've got to be careful in that situation. <laughs> right, par three. Rough, not rough bump. Sand bump or Goliath? Sand bump or Goliath? I have another one to play, Robert. It won't be on this stream. So I'm going to stream this round then. Ian's going to come on. That's the plan. On his freshly procured iPad Mini 5. And he's going to wow you all with his perfect ball striking. As that old phone gets consigned to a, a wind app device only. And then I'll probably come back on after he's done one round. And then he'll probably come back on after I've done one round. So It's the Ian and Tony show this morning. Other streamers are available. Please check local listings. Right, I think we'll go Sniper, Rough and Sand Bump. Shall we? Yes. We'll give it a whirl. <coughs> Sand Bump it is. Is there a YouTube video out there that has the Alba on hole 6? <laughs> I don't know. Snob. There won't be a tournament Christmas week. Is that confirmed, Dixie? Or are you asking? Because PD have never once changed their schedule for anything. No religious festival or day has uh, ever got in the way of tournaments for Playdemic. I would imagine there will be, so yes. Which will have... Monday will be... 23rd, so... Christmas Day will be the Wednesday, I believe. I would imagine there will be, yes. 7-7 seven, seven with the sniper. Min, 8 rings. Eight rings, you say. Now I'd like to aim this at the left lip, which is there. Come on then. How's your luck? <laughs> I saw Ian do that last night twice. I don't even know if we hit the sand there. Do we think we hit the sand? But even with a mistake, or an error, it's safe. But curious. Curious. So yeah, for me, the next tournament, where hopefully they're going to shower us with globe balls and firework balls, that would be lovely. Um, that will be starting on Monday the 23rd. So I shall probably try and qualify any accounts. I'm either going to not play the whole thing, which is unlikely, or I'm going to play a reduced number of accounts. And I'll try and qualify them all on the Monday, I think. Because Christmas Eve for me is traditionally spent wrapping presents for pretty much the whole day. Because <laughs> I'm lazy and I leave it till then. He finished with a 31. Beautiful. Beautiful. Erelix just made it in pro, did he? Oh, nice. 
well, I'm sure he will have a breakdown video up very soon. I know Matt's partial to a hole by hole guide, which is lovely. This shouldn't be moving much more than that. So I don't know, I might go back to the Goliath on the back nine there. Or I might get frisky and try some sort of Guardian backspin play. Keep threatening to try that and I've never done it yet. But the trouble with that is there's not really a hill to roll back on to speak of there on that green. Not sure, we'll see. We'll see. Hey all, thank you for the good luck, thank you for coming. 505 Zoom. Welcome to you too. I'm making the the finger sign. You just can't see me. <laughs> frisky all the way. It's Friday after all. You're damn right, Lee. It's Frisky Friday. Maybe that's what we should title these streams from now on. Right. Um, is this tournament wind? No. Man, nobody likes to forfeit an expert. Nobody, <laughs> except streamers. Um, okay, eight. Left side. Left side, baby. With that bag and that ball. Oh. Try that again. So... Finger precision. That's what it's all about. We've got Wakas again. Let's see if we get the forfeit back from Wakas. Well, let's hope we don't find out. Let's hope we drop this and there is no shootout. We're a first. Okay, seven, seven. Little wind. Very little. Um, so we just want one. Started ignoring ring references on the rough. All I'm interested in is second bounce and bunker now. So I want second bounce to be about there. And I want to use 8.2. Which I'm doing in two pulls today. Because yesterday it felt like I wasn't pulling that straight. Because you go down the hill. There's another perfect, Joe. <laughs> it's just that easy. Until the tab gets below sort of 60% and then it'll be shitting Dogtail Central all over the place. 310. Nearly forgot to look at the yardage. 310. So that is five yards too far, which is 10% on my slider. So it'll be a 40% thorn. At 25% elevation. Did make this last night, crucially, on the back nine of uh, our woeful Rusty account. 10 under for the first nine last night on stream. So bad, so bad. But we did pull it back, we made 14 under on the back. Which might squeak us through. We will see. <clears throat> yes, it was no spin last night. It was Lee. We'll see how that looks now. Maybe that'll be the play. 7-7's seven, a nice win. 3-9. I'm fancying it again. Fancying the no spin. Look at the extra ball guide you get with that lovely thorn out. So, 3-9. Try and get it straight with the wind down. Happy with that. Less happy with that. <laughs> I could sense that coming. I should have let it pass. I never let it pass, but I should have let it pass there. Never mind. We'll get it at the weekend. How is Rusty sitting now? I'm not sure. Um, 
when did I last look? Just after the stream last night, I don't think I've looked yet. We'll have a peek together maybe at the end of the round and see. And say a little prayer for poor Rusty. And I played that so badly yesterday. So badly that front nine. Too tight, I shouldn't have streamed. Just peer pressured into it by Johnson and Ballinger. Should have stuck to my guns. Anyway, it's over now. Good morning, Sai. I'm doing fantastically well, yes. Thank you for asking. I hope you are too, brother. And good luck for the opening rounds. Thank you. You too, brother. Have you played yet? When are you playing? And how's it gone if you have played? How's it gone for everyone that's played? Has he made it? Oh, the little tinker. That's how you hold it. I played that man. Any <laughs> Mika Rudolph sightings this morning? No, I've just uh, I've just seen that. I'm scrolling up the chat. Sorry, Dixie. No, no sightings today. Not yet, anyway. Bless her. She was fun, but she didn't know what she was doing with those Rudolph balls, did she? Let's be honest. Right, so this is looking like par. But it's only opening. Let's see if I've missed anything else that I should have said about. Mm -hmm. You know Ruby, unaware of any silver. You don't know this one, Silver Weasel. 27 yesterday for Lee. In expert, there's four 29s in your bracket. Mm -hmm. Seen a few 29s. Haven't seen many breaking the 30 barrier yet. But 27 solid enough, so. Solid enough. Right. Um, nine is going to be a power five ball. Without doubt. Although it's probably less needed on this account because of the Thor seven. Hmm. Hmm. What's the yardage difference in the sniper and the cat? Is it really necessary to use this little cat here? Eight yards. Because this will go a lot further because it's Thor 7. I'm going to try a sniper on this one. Treat myself, live a little. I should probably start that cooking. Right, hole 9. Let's have a look. 10% drive. Nothing for the second shot. Ola, thank you for the good luck. Thank you, thank you. And lovely to see you. Oh, having fun, good luck. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'm still waking up, so sorry if I've missed a, an obvious reference or gag. Need my coffee, damn. Need my coffee. Do you know what? I'm going to go to Starbucks. I'm going to drive out. I'm going to get it, buy the milk for later, but I'm going to go and get a Starbucks. I'm going to have that eggnog latte they do. It's delicious. Delicious. I could bathe in the stuff. It's that nice. Hole one, Kim method with sniper nine. You aim at plus four. Yeah, that would make sense, Alex. Two yards difference, so... Thank you for confirming. Is that what, have you dropped it, Alex? Playing it that way. Good morning, Gina. Where's my good lick? <laughs> it goes in. Yeah, there you go. Plus four on a sniper nine. Plus two on a sniper ten. Hole one we're discussing there. Kim is beautiful left side play with a smidge of back and a bar of left spin it's a lovely shot which I'll hope to show you in about 7 minutes dropping in open ball for 
our opponent. Still overpowering though. It's lovely, lovely shot. Well played. We might use a tiny bit of OP here just to make sure we get into sniper territory. 10, 3, 10, 7. So, 10, 7. Feels like more sidewind than headwind. It used to be headwind, this. Where is this? 10, 5, 7. Change my mind about the overpower. Well, too much of it. Yeah, I just don't think you need it with a Thor 7. That's way down there. That could be in Thorn range. <laughs> Joking, obviously. No, that should leave us a nice sniper. I would hope. Now, the trouble with this is I haven't played the sniper shot all week, so this will be uh, interesting. You needed it after timing out because of writing this chat. <laughs> oh, Alex. <laughs> Play your game, man. Play your game. Concentrate. Did I figure out how much overpower to use on 8? In pro, we're describing there. Um, I'm going with 80%. But it is kind of wind dependent and direction dependent. But yes, 80% overpower with an extra mile 7 and a berserker is going to be... Uh, my starting point. Good game. What do you hold it like? This must be a replay, surely. Surely to goodness. Right. Let's have a look at this. 9-5. Comfortably in sniper range. In fact, we can uh, back up a bit, you know. Two top, is that what people are using? Two and a bit. Really want to land too close to the rock. Right, let's go. I'm just going to go ten, not ten point three. Oh, be the good angle. Wasn't far from the good angle, to be fair. Wasn't far. We'll take it. We'll take it. Right, what have I missed here? Thorn wrench, yeah. <laughs> I think Phil Beans with a power four. Maybe that's the way to play it, Gary. Maybe that is the best way, because then it's Phil Beans. And you're not having to worry. Maybe that is a good shout. Power four ball instead, yeah. Don't know if I have any power four balls on my pro account. I'll have to look. <laughs> With overpower, it would have been a wedge range. Yeah, we didn't want it in wedge range. Not just no, not, not a fan of the max wedges. Gary v Gary, Gary. Right. Should we have a look at this? No, we can't. We can't, but we can do this because this is pretty much the got less side spin. Not bad. <laughs> Not bad. Don't know why I played that. I think I want a chest to... Need, need another chest. I feel like I haven't done much this front nine. It was close, Al. It was close. 
<laughs> it's been cold war. <laughs> Me too. Me too. Right, so let's get ready for this Kame shot, which we don't need this for. Let's channel the positive vibes of Kame. Let's hold this on one. Oh, he's not made it, has he? Wow, that's close. Good shot. So we're not even going to get a chest. <laughs> I've wasted your time for nothing. What an absolute fool. Well done, Magno. Well done. Right, 13. Par. But we're going to make one on the back nine. We're also going to... We're not going to make four. That's a lie. That's a just a flagrant lie. We're going to make six, damn it. And seven and eight. So let's do it. Let's play some golf clash. Right, where's that vintage ball? There it is. So I guess the only attributes you're really looking for here is probably the power three. Although I don't know. We actually... We're starting at plus two. And we are pulling away from the T, so maybe you do need power three. But it's the wind resistance we're looking at. So any ball of that nature would do you. I would imagine. And it's a sniper. And it's one to one. Plus two rings. And there he is. Have you got it, Ian? Did you get it? Is it excitement time? I hope you did. What time is it? Nine... 30. That will be fast. I don't even know what time it is. You got it! You got it, everyone! Hey! Ooh, can't wait now. Right, to calm yourself, Tony. There's golf to be played here. Golf to be played. Made an Alba on 11. Nice, Alex. No more timing out, though, okay? You just stick to sink and extras. How's that? You're going to run out of Scottish... Is it my turn? Oh, I thought I panicked there. I thought I'd wasted half my time reading the chat. Yeah, one day. One day we'll run out. <laughs> Jamie Blanco in the chat. Sneaking in there. On the lowdown. How we doing, mister? That thing I sent you that Eric's been working on, I've got a new um, a new version to send you, Jamie. It looks amazing. Still walking home, bless him. Oh, are you going to unbox it live on streaming? I think you should. That would be that would be good. Right, one. I've lost the spins. Where's my notes? Quick, one left. I'm a bit back. Something like that. And then plus two yards. Which is there. And then nine three. Which we'll try and do like this. Now we hit a Ballinger on the front nine. And it literally stopped on the lip, but it was right on line. So that's a perfect. Give me my hole in one. Don't miss right again. Please don't miss right. Yes! Yes! Take that whole one. Now you're my bitch. Lovely. Thank you, Kimmy. Thank you, Ian. Thank you, whoever brought the shot up. I don't know whose shot it is. In this era of shot creditation. Nice. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Look at the chat light up. Booms to be seen. Thank you all. So this is the start of what is going to be a stupendous back nine. You may want to record this because, you know, just saying. It's going to be something special. Oh, what is this? I don't want to do that. What? What did I? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Don't get distracted. Focus, Tony. Focus. Thor's sniper. Let's just check while we're here. Thor sniper. Kingmaker? Kingmaker. Check. Now before we enter, let's just check the chat. 
do things in the right order. Oh, I'm going to scroll for days now. Days. There we are. I got it. He's walking home. Hi, everyone. Blah, blah, blah. Aerosmith, welcome, welcome, welcome. Messed up the first night and closed at a minus 25. Hoping an albatross on the back nine can save you. I think you'll be all right. You what minus twenty five going into the the eighteenth? I should hope it would save you. Twenty five will hopefully be enough. I'm hoping a twenty four is enough. But let's not talk about that. <laughs> There's no moral standards in here, Gary. Absolutely none. He does have to uh, check his language at the door though on the way in. Jaime Blanco, settle settle this debate for us. Hi, me, Jimmy. How are we pronouncing your first name? Because I always say Jamie, and I know loads of people say hi, mate. And it would be nice to know one way or t'other. My lucky day. Maybe. <laughs> it's your Morris Minor getting serviced. Is that what you imagine Ian drives around in a Morris Minor? That's quite, um, that's quite amusing, actually. I like that. We're going for hi, mate. Well, so I've been saying it wrong the whole time. And you haven't corrected me. I feel like a fool. Hi, mate, it is. I mean, that is how it's spelt, so you would think that. So there we go, everyone. The biggest dilemma in Golf Clash has now been solved. It's hi, mate. Not Jamie. Don't make the same mistake I've been making. Hey, Kunwa. Welcome, welcome. I cannot read it. But I hope, I'm sure that's a message of love. So thank you for it very much. But watch out, because Terry's, Terry's looking to bring the hammer down. <laughs> right, bigger win, so just one in a smidge-ish. This will be loads of rings, won't it? It'll be 8.8 .8 rings. I'll try and pull it this time. No, I've instantly instantly regretted that. Eight point eight. Go there. And a wee tiny bit of overpower. Just a feather mind. See if we can get a bit closer. No, it's still short. Still a good six, seven yards short of where we want to be. But we'll take it. What was the adjustment on one? It's um, one to one plus two rings. That's what um, Kimmy said. I would highly recommend watching her video. I've put it... The post I made about my notes in um, Elite and in 19th, I've added her video link there. So you can go and watch it. She makes the, she shows you three different shots, or three attempts, all of which go in with different balls. So yeah, one to one plus two rings, and you're using point two backspin and one left spin. And if you've got a sniper nine, you want to start at the plus four instead of the plus two. Oh, that's too keen. That's unlucky. Right. Let's see if we can keep this magic alive. Nine rings. That's big wind. Massive, in fact. Can we go up? Can we go more? More there. Yeah, that's not through the hole. At ten point one, smallest of push-ups. Now we're hitting perfects for fun. Come on, back nine of the age is coming up. Just don't be short. It's going to be short. Why didn't you put the ball guy through the hole? Because you didn't need to. <laughs> Told you. Told you. Only by a smidgen, though. Saved our friend. Saved our friend. I 
can't believe you took that sh shot properly. <laughs> Why didn't you just pull back an insta release? Waste no time. Waste no time. Right, so that's delightful. Delightful. I thought I was going to regret not having the ball guide through the hole, but I definitely prefer coming in from the right with left spin. That is certainly how we're going to. I'm going to try and play that later. Don brings a luck. Of course you do, Don. Nice to see you, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Fenzel was right. What's that? I've missed something here. Oh, to, oh hi, hi, May. That's exactly how you pronounce it, as Gary's type. High, as in the opposite of low, and May, as in the month of the year. I think. I'm sure you'll tell us of a lot of those. Lots of booms. Thank you all very much, very much, very much. Did you play any elevation? On that shot, I played 10%, um, which almost always equates to 1 to 1 plus 1 um, from that position. So, yeah, we were 9 rings and we went 10.1. And don't there was a, a slight push up at the end there, very slight, very fine. Without which it probably wouldn't have gone in to be honest. So clearly good luck, but you maybe want to think about that because you are pulling down downhill a little. Um, probably you need to crank your volume all the way up. It's because I haven't got any mic control audio settings nonsense. What I can do though is turn this music down, and I can talk into the microphone like this if it helps. Um. Sorry for anyone that's just frightened. Yeah, and I'm aware that that's an issue, Don. I need to start using OBS to stream. So I can control things like mic levels. But I need a computer that can do OBS first. So there's a sequence of things that need to happen. So we'll get there eventually. Eventually. Micro adjustments for the win, indeed. Right, let's stop basking in the glow of that albatross and... Let's drop hole three. <laughs> Don't need the wind app for three. We just need the Peter Johnson method. Or should we try the... No, let's try this. Now, did we say we were going to try the full backspin that somebody's posted where they drop this? Should we try that? Instead of the 5.5 .5 job. Let me see if I can find that, actually. I think somebody sent it to me. Mm -hmm. I don't know who it was, though. Go get Was it Barry? No. Oh, I don't know who it was. We'll just try and play it. this and let's let's hurry up and get off so Ian can get on and show you this fantastic new toys but I'm very very excited to see what this man can do with a good device because we've all seen what he can do with a shit Android phone so just imagine how good he's gonna be now and imagine how much better the screen's gonna be with a bigger game screen on it instead of that slither of android phoneness that we all see oh he's got a tablet he's got a tablet all right sorry only the best tablet you can get for golf clash in many people's opinions right we're in we're straight in stop faffing around nine four so we're going to take off four two so that you know do the wind at the end tony i'm going to try it this guy said all of that and all of that i think It just looks wrong. I'm not doing it. Come with my way. Right. Start in the right place would help. And 9 4 minus 4 2. It's going to be 5 2. There's a perfect for a change on this hole. Usually we hit a great left with absolute routine. It's going to be short. Right, on the other account that I'm going to play later on, after we've 
I'll enjoy the in-stream. I am going to try the APOC single bounce rough bump where we land straight in this rough here. Stop moving the screen in here and just roll up to the hole. Because I genuinely think that that is the most likely way to hold this. It doesn't require a decent dose of luck. Let me catch up on this chat because it's gone whizzing through as usual. Yes, we answered the elevation question. Twenty five and rookie. Nice one, Kumar. Nice one. Well played. Well played indeed. Oh, this is, I was gonna say tap this in, but it's not that close, is it? Ooh. Great left. Do want to get a great left there. <laughs> he made fun of Blanco's name and now he's split. Jaime will be back at his leisure. Which one did he get? I believe. I don't believe. I know. He got the iPad Mini 5. Or do you mean which type of iPad Mini 5? Because I don't know that. I think he was going to get the 64 gig black one. Because that's what I would get. At one point I was going to be buying it for Ian. Because this is obviously through the wonderful whip round that Fenzie did. Um, well, he's paid for most of this, let's put it that way. Um, so yeah, Fenzie sent me the money to buy in Britain to have it shipped to Ian. So I almost bought him the rose gold one without asking. Because I thought he'd like that, but... No, I think he's going to go for the black one. Or has gone for the black one, I should say. He'll probably tell you himself once he's uh, finished celebrating his purchase. Hey, Stu. Welcome. I didn't catch that. <laughs> Shut up, Siri. I need to turn that off. Good morning, Posty. I'll go with Posty. That won't confuse my stupid phone. Uh, thank you for the good luck, sir. And thanks for coming. Much, much appreciated. So, yeah, super cool of everyone, Sarah. Um, really, really cool. Yet another example of this community and the fantastic spirit within it. Like nothing I've ever seen before, to be honest. In terms of strangers who don't know each other coming together. Good morning, Steve. Uh, we're trying. We had a bang average front nine, but we've started better on the back. Started better on the back. Um, but we'll see. So, sorry, I'm just trying to tweak something on the notes. Um, this is the par three. This will just be a, a good old-fashioned miss to the left, as usual. Uh, sorry, to the right. Oh, can't wait for this coffee though. Can't wait. Didn't leave, he was driving, goddammit. See? He doesn't leave streams. I'm like that though, I'll, once I'm in a stream, I don't want to leave it. But if I need to do something, I'll probably go and get another device to do that other thing so I can carry on watching the stream. I don't know why, a bit funny like that. Dorks, dorks he says. Right, um, still want a kingmaker, but thank you for asking, Clear Demi. So one to one. Um, don't like this, if I've got the wrong spins on. That's not what I've been doing, but I'm gonna do that today. I'm going to go seven, seven, seven. And a great left, just because I can. <laughs> I nearly missed the rough. So yeah, we sail by on the right. I've given up with this hole now. Resigned myself to defeat.
Oh yes, this is the bracket where I've got um, Jaime, as I'm now pronouncing correctly, and uh, and Jesse, and I think they're both in this bracket. Absolutely. Have you played Jaime? I didn't even check to be honest. We'll have to have a look, Stu. We'll have a look after this. See where we sit. few holes on this all that's how you make the hole in one I wasn't paying any attention how did he do that Jay from come on you boys in green well played well played Jay is Jay the boy or is Jay the girl that's the question or is Jay the donkey <laughs> should we watch that let's watch that together and try and learn something we're all about education on this channel, as you're well aware. So he's got a win ball out, which, you know, is never a bad idea on a tournament par three. He's gone all the left, three back. Same adjustment we're making. Where's his ring play? He's got the red ring outside the fairway. And how many rings does he go? That's crucial. That looked like five rings. And we already know what happens next. Does he hit perfect? He does. So that's when I maybe go back and look at and see if I can pinch a better setup. Because I don't mind wasting a win ball on this on the weekend. But I'm not going to do it in open. No, no. No, no, no. Right, let's crack on. I know Ian's itching to get on now, no doubt. Itching to show you his new toy. Uh, this one, should we try one more time? One more for the road with the Guardian? Why not? I almost did it again. I almost just bought another 45. They need to move these buttons. I'm not going to touch them. Down here, they need to go somewhere else. Because they're too easily hit there. By idiots like me. Got my gems back, by the way. Anyone that was worried or concerned. Pandemic did refund them, so... Props to them. He's just walked in, having a Jane a brew before he does anything. That sounds delightful. These are the Fridays we dream of, Ian. New iPad minis, Jane a brew, no work. All that you've got to worry about today is hitting perfect, my friend. Nice problems to have. Oh, I, well, I think live opening. That will obviously elongate the stream, though, because you'll probably have to then install Golf Clash. And you could do what a lot of these unboxers do, and you could unbox it, get it all ready, set up accounts loaded and all that, and then put it back in the box and then fake it. Wink, wink. That's what a lot of them do. Do what you want to do, sir. It's your iPad. You can do with it what you like. Because there'll be a learning curve. Whilst it'll make you a better player, it, there will definitely be a learning curve. I know when I went from phone to tablet, it was... Um, it's just... this. Well, the screen's just so much bigger. <laughs> it takes a little bit of getting used to, but you, you'll be fine. 7-1 gives us 7 rings. 6 top only. Starting somewhere down here. Just where the ball guide starts shooting right a bit. Which I'm struggling to find today. That'll do. Seven rods, seven rings. And a wee bit of right and a wee bit of OP. Not a lot of either. Not a lot. Oh, did I change bags? I really hope we change to the Guardian. Who knows? That sounds like a plan, Ian. That sounds like a good plan. Very good plan. Very good plan. So let's hope we've switched to the Guardian, otherwise we're snookered. Snookered. <laughs> It'll be like the episode of Friends where Joey can't open the milk. <laughs> <coughs> oh, yeah. 
Touche, touche. Oh no, Don, you forfeited a par three thinking it was a shootout. <laughs> yeah. Don't play when sleepy. Good advice. I should have took that advice yesterday. I should not have streamed that round. Mark Lepla, I've missed your arrival. I apologise. Welcome along, sir. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And Brian Ellis, too. Hello to you. Oh. And did we bring the Goliath? Uh, the Guardian, we did. I'm going to go one right because that leaves us all the backspin. And yeah, we'll go seven rings. I have to hurry up a bit now. And that's more curl than I've been using. So it's good to test things. Oh, we missed it the other side, which is good news. So all the backspin in one right seems like it's going to give you the... It's going to kill it quicker, which is what we want. Maybe that's the way ahead. Maybe it is. You used to be in a clam with Jay, did you, Dixie? Ah, very good. Clearly a very good player if he's dropping holes like that that nobody else is dropping, frankly. Good morning, Danny. Smash it, I will try. I will try. Fun putt here. Whee! Safely in. Take our birdie. Move along. Nothing to see here. You were watching me in a bar last night having a quiet G&T and then the dog barked <laughs> and everyone was looking at you. That's classic. I like that, Mark. Very good. Very good. <laughs> Love it. Yep. There you go. Posty concurring that an iPad will take you to the next level. If there is, if that's even possible, Ian. If it's even possible. We've all pulled the wrong way, baby. <laughs> all of us. I remember power slicing the wrong way on stream once. That was a fun day. That was a fun day. Is this a shootout? Have I waited? Okay, may as well play it now that I'm here. Oh, oh, actually, this is a good chance to try this. Not that that's the wind we're going to get, but... I just want to try something different. Um, let's just go... Let's start at one to one. I just want to see how the ball reacts on the green here with uh, loads of backspin. Because there's no bank to speak of, so now it's not going to work that way. There is a bit of a bank here to come off. But it looks, looks too hard. Looks too hard. I guess we'll stick with either the sand bump or the goliath until we can be more confident. Good luck. Good luck, sir. Right. I need coffee. Ian needs to get on and show you this wonderful new toy. So let's hurry up and finish. What are we on? 15 minus 9 is 6, according to my maths. So that's that bag and that ball. So, we've made one unlikely albatross on this back nine. Can we make a second? I did promise you a back nine for the ages. So if I'm going to be true to that, then this kind of has to go in, really. Oh. 
26 top here. It's seven. Main three. Oh, I can't really get to it that way. No, we're going to run out of time. I'm not a fan of adjusting that way. Not a fan at all. But it looks like we haven't botched it up this time, so that's uh, a promising start for this albatross attempt. Let's go, let's go. The apparel you're wearing for the Christmas song is very gay. Really? I have submitted my entry for the Christmas song. It's, um, I think you're all going to love it. Let's just leave it at that. It's not on video, so you will not see this chiselled, fantastic looking face of mine. You will only hear my dulcet tones, but yeah. I got the last part of the song. The last from the four, three, two, one, and then the repeat of the last line. So I've literally got the last line of the song. Unless he's got everyone to sing that part. Maybe he's got everyone to sing that part. But you're going to love it. You're going to love it. I promise. All I'll say is... And this ties in with a film I watched the other night, actually. Um, let's take the shot and then we'll talk more about that. Right, where do we need to be? Try that. Eight five. Oh, no, no, no. Haven't got a clue, Coral. And a great left. Maybe that's the combination though. Haven't got a clue curl and a Ballinger. Is that what it needed? Is it? Oh, it nearly was. It nearly was what it needed. Yeah, so I watched that film about Queen the other day. Uh, Bohemian Rhapsody, I think it's called. Not a bad film, actually. Quite enjoyed it. I think the guy that plays Freddie Mercury does a very good role. Um... And I was inspired for my Christmas song entry. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> it's gay as a maple. <laughs> Captain Rationale, welcome along. I don't know. Sand bump was close for you yesterday. Stopped on the hole both times. That's, that is close. I haven't got it very close at all. Um, I don't know if I want to keep playing it, if I'm honest. Pardon me. Yeah, I don't know if I've got seven sorted yet, Mark. I fear not, but um, we'll do whatever you want to do. If you want to do the sand bump, we'll do the sand bump. If you want to do the Goliath, we'll do the Goliath. You can pick. I don't care, because I know it's going to miss either way. <laughs> You went to school with Brian May's son. Now there's a claim to fame. Did he also have a, a wild perm as well? Or was that just his dad? Right. Ooh, tournament wind. Kind of. I'm going to try this just to see. Just to rule it out. We tried this on stream the other day. <laughs> we ended up in the sand. So 8-2. 20% was what we needed here, I think. 10-1. Just want to see what this does. To be fair, that's as close as I've got playing the quarterback, so I might, 
I might switch to that for the weekend. I'm sick of the quarterback shot now. Unfortunately, not just his dad. I met up with him in Portugal once. <laughs> How random. Did you go around for tea and stuff? Was it that kind of friendship, Sam? Were you a, a regular guest at the May household? That would be amazing. So we've gone the same way. Without the same results, but... At least we'll get a chest for our efforts. Which is nice. Right, let's put that password back in there. And let's play hole seven. Right, someone tell me. Sand bumper Goliath. I'll go with whoever types whatever in the chat first. Board PC guy. Welcome, Chris. Chili King in the house. Nice to see you, sir. Gold chest as well. Lovely. You're glad you got all three done. Yeah, I'll bet, Danny. Can't play when inebriated. He did visit a few times with Brian and his wife, etc. It's only visited with mums. Ah, okay. Makes sense. Makes sense. Sand bump. Dunk it. Ooh. That's a new one. No. We'll save the dunking for uh, another day. So 10, 20, 30% minimum numbers. Have we got our kingmaker? 10%, no, 30%. Min numbers. I think it's all the top and all the right, but I don't know if people have been taking a bit off the top spin here. Six accounts in the same day, jeez Louise. That's like a full-time job, Captain Rational. Guardian dunk, you, you pervert. Right, that's a big old wind. A big old wind. No. A hole you cannot afford to be wasting time on. Left lip. I like it. 9.4 rooms. We've hit perfect, so. Oh, we've also hit the. Oh, it's not safe, Ian. It's not safe. Ooh. That was a bigger wind, to be fair. Maybe it needed more. I don't think we did anything wrong. Maybe a smidge over the min number if you're going to get a big, big wind like that. <coughs> so, from the rough then. Deary me. Deary me. Good news is it should be a relatively straight win, so it should be a perfect inning. But as regular viewers of the channel will know, perfect rough irons are not my speciality. <laughs> full top spin, yeah. We want full full top there. Drop it like it's hot. Right, concentrate now. Don't spoil what's becoming a decent round with a dropped shot. Don't need that. Mm -hmm. Can we land here? Probably. Is it perfect in in? Yes, it is perfect in in. Happy days. Good save. Good save. No round is complete without a potential disaster. So. You're back five minutes in the loo to watch. <laughs> I'm off to the loo to watch Tony. <laughs> Don't be telling your colleagues that, Nick. Don't be telling them that. Enjoy your shit, Nick. <laughs> Ian straight in there. T 
to the point. Enjoy that poo, won't you? Right. Eight and nine to go. And then we'll close this out and open the door. Clear the stage for Mr. Ballinger's arrival. Oh, it was another 19th family. Good luck. I'm so, so bad at checking who I'm playing. Terrible. Yeah, I don't know that we hit the sand. I think we almost hit the rough. Should we have a little look just for educational purposes to see where that did land? Because we thought that was going to be a safe. Even a bad shot we thought was going to be on the fringe. But Let's have a quick peek. And see what the landing spot was. He's curling one out while you curl one in. <laughs> Brilliant. Love it. Love it. That's hilarious. Right. Let's check we didn't made, made no mistakes as well. So. Left edge. Red ring just out the rough line. That's what I'm trying to look for. It's maybe a bit bold on the high side. Maybe it could have been back a touch. Ring should have been... Eight Four, was it? That seems okay. Any overpower? Maybe a slight smidge of overpower, but really nothing to write home about. And that hits the rough. That is a confirmed rough bounce, not a sand bounce. So that would explain why we've shot all the way through. Um. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, there we go. There was a tiny bit of overpower on the pullback as well. So if you're going to play that shot, be careful. Be safe, folks. Be safe out there. Now, what we're we doing? Thorn. We need to make this. This has to go. Has to go. To miss this twice in the same round would be... In fact, let's have a look. Who are we looking for? Jesse and Jaime. I think have they played? I think Jaime said he's only played a little bit, and Jesse's not one to play early, is he? He's always a a last minute Charlie, so he'll be down here somewhere, waiting to go. There's Jaime, and there's Jesse. So neither have played yet. So let's get these two holes out of the way. And then I'm going to get coffee. I shall have to watch the beginning of your stream, Ian, from the car. So there'll be limited chat from me while you're uh, showing us your new toy. But once I'm armed with that eggnog latte, I'll be back. And it's me and I'm not ready. Let's say good luck this time to our fellow 19th holer. 8894. All of that. About that much of that. Safe as houses. Eight, eight, nine, four. I'm still getting used to the number of rings you have to pull on this delicious Thor seven. Great left, but that's fine. We hit great left for fun on this tee shot. I'd be surprised if we didn't, to be honest. That's going to go too far. Stop, stop, stop. Stop. 3 or 3 Good. Happy with that. So, 2 yards shy. 2 yards shy, which is 4% on the slider, so 54% club. Unfortunately, you're not going to get to watch Joseph's shot here, but because of the nature of Golf Clash Notebook, once you've put that percentage in, if I move away from this screen now, it will not stay there, which is a pain in the arse. <coughs> it's a great tool, don't get me wrong, but that should that should stick until I reset it, I think. Unless I'm using it wrong, which is quite possible. Tony Halls brings, out, brings Greta out for his rush. <laughs> okay. Greta Thunberg. 
What? What are you talking about? I've obviously missed something here. Greta has Greta hates climate change and big vi big prisons, but she loves Tony. Uh, right, seven nine four four. I think we will have to use some backspin this time. Which is just f just fine. Four four, please. And a quick hit. Oh, you fanny. That's just shite. <laughs> That's all that is. Absolute shite. Right, we need to make that on the weekend. Damn it. You can change that setting. Can you? How do I do it? I guess in settings, probably. I'll have to find out later. I'll have to find out. Eggnog latte, that could not sound any more disgusting. I agree. It could not sound any more disgusting, Danny. But it's like nectar. But then I like I like a sweet drink. I'm not one of these that has black coffee, no sugar. I'm not a real coffee lover. I like to add all kinds of nonsense to mine. <coughs> Excuse me. You can change that setting with like that. Yes, Ian will be on straight after this. Click on his beautiful face on the slimmest of off chances that you're not subscribed to his channel. In fact, somebody drop the link, that would be easier. Do it when we're on 18, and then we can all funnel over there for what will be a good time, let me tell you. A great time, in fact. Tea drinker, oof. Can't drink. Well, I can drink tea. I would wouldn't say I ever enjoy a cup of tea. It doesn't taste of anything. It's a pointless beverage. Tea. There we go. Hi, me on duty. It's the Bushwhackers account. Lovely, lovely. Don't forget to drop that link and all the other places you said you were going to drop it, Ian. Which I think was quite a list. Quite a long list of places. Right. Let's let him have this one. Oh, he's too fast for me. Thank you. And good luck. Who's Jouster? Do I know Jouster? I feel like I should. I feel like I should. Mark! With the... I'm guessing that's Aussie 5. Thank you so much, sir. Much, much appreciated. Show some love to Mark, please, for his generosity. Right, 26 with one to go. We will not be troubling the scorers at the top, but, but that's okay. Um, we're going to stick with the sniper, as soon as we know that's more than enough with the Thor 7 off the tee. 10% followed by no percents, followed by a win 5 ball. Right, let's go. One more Alba. One more. The Bucky. No, I've not cracked out the Bucky. <laughs> Buck fast, for those that don't know, is a fortified wine that the homeless people of Glasgow enjoy on street corners. I was going to say brewed. I don't think you brew fortified wine, but distilled, would that be the word? By monks, nonetheless. From the Buckfast Abbey. A screw cap, you know? You know what I'm talking about now, yeah? Give it a go. <laughs> Hot tea or iced tea? Because the only civilised way to drink tea is sweetened with ice. <laughs> Bock. Cold tea. Could not think of anything worse. But I know that's a thing over in the States, isn't it? Sweet teas and stuff. Yeah. No, not for me. Give me a over sweetened coffee any day, preferably hot. But I will take a nice latte. 11.8, that's 
big wind. But then it is a berserker, so shouldn't be surprised really. Let's try and do it in one pull. No, we can't. Ten. Somebody's put a tree in the way. Perfect Tisha. Just what we wanted. Just played your front nine. Round was ticking away nicely so you got to hole seven. Put a bit more coral on. Ended up in the rough. Oh no. How far did that go? 387. Uh, playing the whole safe from now. Taking your body. Yes. Yes. It's about picking your, picking your battles, Robert. Playing safe where you need to, I think. <laughs> they love it down Glasgow Green. Absolutely. Bucky in the brown bags. Oh, and you've played that way into the drink. Left side. Fair enough. Whatever's going to work. Whatever's going to work for you. Da -da -da -da. Hot tea and iced coffee are the devil. They're the devil, Bobby Boucher. <laughs> Each to their own, Dom. I'm not going to say you're wrong. But you're wrong. Right, 11. Another beefy wind. But we're over, so that's fine. Right, we used all of this and we were a little bit left last time. Seventy nine. I'm going to have whatever's left back. Great, right. Now I just want it to be safe. Be safe. Not bad, actually. Not bad for a bad shot. We'll take it. So that will seal it. That will seal a better back nine than we had at our front nine. So, stuff to work on. Um, but not, not displeased with that, I'll be honest. I think we've got a far better shot for hole one now, thanks to Kim A. Or Ian. Where did that shot come from, Ian? Please tell us who we should be tipping our hats to because I don't think Kimmy I think she said she got it from you but I don't know where you got it from is it a Ballinger original Mr Magoo good morning thank you for the good luck you've missed this one we're just about to close this one out but the, the better news is Head over to Ian's channel, because he's about to jump on, with a little surprise at the start of his stream. And we're going to quickly try and forfeit this, because we owe him this one. Good. I need to find out who Jouster is, unless somebody told me in chat, maybe I've missed it. I don't know. But anyway, 28. Um... Which could be better, I'll be honest. That's obviously unexpected on three. So I guess if, if 11 counts us out not getting one, then maybe 28 is about my glass ceiling for this tournament, quite possibly. We'll see. Although eight, to be fair, eight should be going. So 30 is not outreach. That's what my target's going to be for the weekend, 30. We'll try and do a 30 later on. So we'll come back. Um, tablet to charge, Ian to watch, coffee to be bought and consumed. Lots to be done in the next hour, two and a half hours or so. But I'll be back whenever Ian finishes his next round, or his first round of the day. So I hope to see all of you over there. Thank you all for coming to my stream. I've enjoyed it immensely, as always. Thank you for the continued support. It's uh, humbling to have a loyal and consistent audience of wonderful people like yourself. So thank you for that. Um, see you at Ian's. Best of luck on your own rounds and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.